Okay, welcome back. And I had quite a good experience today actually from <laughs> skating. So obviously I haven't skated for 20 years and to be honest I thought to myself I had it in me still to skate like I thought I can still do it and I nearly fell on my ass quite a few times. Luckily I never scratched up the skate or anything like that. I'll just wipe this one off because um, it's raining outside and then I don't want my boot to be smelly and sticky. Um, yeah, so these are the Power Slide Zoom 100. And I can't really tell you much about them because I don't really know much about skates no more. You know, they're all changed, everything's changed. 2020 now, you know what I mean? 20 years ago. So 2000 to 2020, it's just crazy. But they've improved in their skates, I can tell you that. So I can change the tracks to four wheels. To be honest, I should have started with four wheels instead of three wheels. I just learned that now. <laughs> I never skated on three wheels before. To be honest, I don't think they had three wheels when I was skating in 2000. Anyway, let's get let's get down to it. So it comes with Power Slide 100 mm 86A Hurricane wheels, and they are perfect, really good. Um, you can put this boot in an oven. But go to Power Slide's um, website and you know research it before you do it because I've seen a few videos, not this boot, different boots. Some people put the stock in the oven, they take off the track and then they put it in the oven. But yeah, just do your research because um, I was going to put this in the oven, but I didn't have to do that. Um, the instruction says try it on first and it fit perfectly. Um, I've skated with it for about 20 minutes today, it's my first little session and I nearly fell on my ass. it was hard, I couldn't stop, I don't know, I've got to like, get back into skating now. So, this is something new to the channel, um, just different content, I'll do a different playlist because obviously you know, my channel is about everything and everything, anything and everything, and um, yeah, I think people would like to see trails and seasides and stuff in a 360 cam, obviously it won't be always looking at me, be looking around and stuff like that, Maybe a bit of history there, if, you know, if I spot something. I'm not really good at history, to be honest, but yeah, you know what I mean. Some, like, info, full information about the area. Stuff like that. But, so far, I'm impressed with the skate. They've done a brilliant job. And to be honest, I was a bower man. Um, this is, like, my third skate I've had. Yeah, my third skate, yeah, my third skate. Usually, um, bower, and I think the other one was some cheap cheap crap i can't remember but yeah my best skates were bauer but power slide i never heard of them you know i watched a guy called um ricardo lino yeah ricardo lino i think he's a wheel addict i just started following that guy's channel what a channel mate he's got a really good channel if you like skating go and check him out i think his name is ricardo lino if i can remember yeah really good channel to watch but as i said perfect skate really really good skate i'm really happy with it but my skating skills are not all there yet. <laughs> oh my God. Obviously it's wet outside. I'm not gonna blame the wet because my balance was just unbelievable. You know, I was like a clown, but I'm just jumping about. At least I never thought. Um, I never recorded it because I didn't want to break my cameras. You know what I mean? I need to get comfortable with these skates and then I'm gonna start skating. And these are off-road skates as well. You can actually do off-road trails. So that's the reason I'm doing trails um like videos you know what i mean so when i go to the trail see the river or whatever is down in kind of roads or whatever and hopefully we get some good footage just let me know in the comments below um if you're into skating or what kind of content i should do with skating because i'm going to do a different playlist obviously so i need to start working on my playlist on this channel now and that's about it so the reason i got back into skating and this is no joke I was flipping through my Facebook page and um, back in the days like, well, 2000, there was an old abandoned uh, cinema, S-Max it was called, in Reading. And as kids, you know, you run around in the abandoned warehouse playing hide and seek or whatever, bullshit, or what was it called actually? It was, it was called um, Bulldog, is it Bulldog? Yeah, something like that, Bulldog. Yeah, something like that, Bulldog. Um, yeah, so we all got together and we all cleared up one big platform, massive platform it was, 
massive. It's like a skating rink. We put all the junk, all you know, the cinema equipment and whatever up there is all just crap basically. All in the middle, and we had, we created a big skating rink. It was awesome. And you know, when I left that area, like what, 2000, maybe nine, I think around that time, the other kids. You know, the younger kids, they were still using it. So that warehouse has only just been knocked down, I think five years ago, or maybe six years ago, I can't remember. But yeah, it brought back memories, and I thought to myself, this is a good exercise. Um, you know, if you want to do something, what's, you want to burn weight in that, instead of going to the gym, I'd rather do something where I'm going to enjoy, you know what I mean? I can do anything on skates, go around, do my thing, oh, it'd, be, it'd be quite good. So my daughter, she's got a pair as well, she'll be back here soon. She doesn't know they're obviously here, so she's going to be so excited to get on them. So yeah, that is my little story about skating. So you know, if you're new here and you like skating, come and join the Empire. Because as I said, this channel is about everything and anything. And let me know in the comments below. So everyone stay safe, peace out. And hopefully you enjoy a bit of skating footage in 360. Peace out.